Right everyone, welcome back to here. Right, I'm going to do an unboxing of the EK Archery Cobra Adder. Right, let's take a look what you get in the box. So this was bought from Merlin Archery in the UK. The crossbow itself is £310 for the deluxe version, which is the version you get everything with, and then you pay around about 20 quid postage, I think it was, or something like that. Postage, handling and tax. So, in the top of the box, you get the crossbow. We'll get rid of these bits, don't we need those. And in this part, you get the stock. And what I'll do at a later date, I will do a setup of this to show you how to build it basically. So this is a self cocking crossbow, it's almost pump action and you cock it like that. At a later date I can also show you the difference between this and the R9 and the R9 RX because there is a difference. Only the Cobra Adder can take the magazine because it has some features that have been added and taken away. So there's the crossbow, very nice. Seems a really nice build. It's steel and some sort of composite plastic, but it's very tough. So yeah, there's that. And then you've got the stock there. And I think, depending on what model you get, these are slightly different as well. And this you just press it, and it's got different positions, so it can lock in. This part's uh, metal, this part's the hard plastic again. But the overall build of this, initial looks it, yeah, very, very nice. So that's the top section. Underneath we have the other parts and the accessories. So, looks like we've got a little package here with... Let's get that open. You've got the foregrip there. There's the foregrip. And this looks like a second butt plate. So you can have a flat one or a slightly extended one. Here's the 130 pound prod, already strung. Yeah, that's a nice little feature that is, that you don't actually have to put the string on. It looks like you've got a little warning thing there. To avoid early string damage, wax the string frequently. The manual. This is a sling. UK Archer Sling and it's elasticated so it's springy. The buckles seem really good quality. I like that. And that's a single position sling as well, so it just hooks on with one one connection basically. Here we've got a spare string and stringer and knock ends actually. Yeah, so you've got spare knock ends stringer and a spare string and the instructions how to do that this is the sight so in here you get cleaning cloth the sight itself and the battery that's quite good. Here's probably the feature most people want to see, which is the magazine. So there's the magazine there. And this just basically hooks on with these two hooks onto part of the crossbow, and then you just screw it on. It takes literally seconds. Yeah, this is well built. You can see where the bolts would sit in there and it can enable broadheads as well, certain broadheads. There's where you put the sight on. Again, yeah, nice quality. I quite like that. And there's the arm that holds down the bolts, which acts like the spring that would hold down a bolt on a traditional crossbow. Not sure if you can see these at the bottom there, but you've also got 
some safety glasses, five bolts so you can shoot straight away, some rail lube or wax and that's the allen key for the sight and, and the little bolt that holds on the magazine. So what I'll do now, I'll put all this on a tabletop and you can see what you get. For 330 quid all in, I think you get a decent amount of stuff there really. The crossbow itself, very nice, looks very nice quality, feels very nice, same as the magazine. Stock's pretty good quality as well, foregrip, just a standard foregrip, but still good. Um, the red dot sight's probably on the cheaper end, but again, it does the job and that's what you want really. This whole package, straight out the box, you've got the crossbow, the bolts to shoot it, the sight to use with a battery, you've got your safety features, spare string. So pretty much if anything went wrong, you're sort of covered. So there you go, that is what you get in the box if you buy an EK Archery Cobra Adder. Quite a lot of decent things I think. Uh, in the next video I can do a video of myself putting this together and we'll talk about the parts and that and, and how it goes together and stuff like that if you like. So yeah, look out for that in the next video. Alright, I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope you found it helpful. These can be bought from various different places. I got mine from Merlin Archery. There are other places you can buy them. Alright, hope you enjoyed it. See you later.